Robust cybersecurity measures are also being implemented to protect against domain name system related threats. This includes domain name system security extensions, implementation to ensure the integrity and authenticity of domain name system data, collaboration with local and international organizations such as Internet Corporation for Assigned Names and Numbers, Participation in discussions and decisions related to global domain name systems policies help in ensuring that African perspectives are considered in the global internet governance landscape. When I can stand for the Internet Corporation for Assigned Names and Numbers, basically uh, it's about you know, coordinating the unique identifier system you know, of the internet, and that's what ICANN does. And what does that mean for Africa? Well, it means a lot, actually, because uh, Although Africa today is about, what, 20% usage of the internet, it's quite important for so many you know, issues of developmental issue. And uh, now the work of ICANN is important for Africa in terms of, uh, of course, the internet itself, but the whole, uh, I would say, policy development around it, you know, uh, around those uh, unique identifiers is important for Africa to know about it and also to be part you know, of making that policy. So in that regard, uh, I believe that it's quite important for Africa to be uh, participating. Um, so what efforts does ICANN do and your team do in Africa to, to incur, raise awareness on this? Well, uh, many things actually. I would just uh, recall that uh, ICANN's presence in Africa actually was triggered by uh, what we call the, the Dakar Declaration by the African Minister in charge of ICTs, who really wanted uh, um, ICANN to be much more present in Africa, but also Africa to contribute more to ICANN. That was 2011. Uh, today what we have done is we do have a strategy for Africa, and that strategy calls for two things. It's about, of course, promoting participation to ICANN, but also it's about supporting, I would say, the African DNS you know, industry. So, in that regard, our strategy has a few kind of program and project, and uh, a few of them, a few of them quickly, uh, to simplify what we've been doing in Africa, uh, we set up forums, you know, forums to discuss, you know, GNS, for instance, is quite important, as it was the first time that uh, the uh, professionals in that regard are meeting and uh, discussing the issues and ideas, and also collaborating. But we also establish you know, topical workshops that really address, you know, issues such as, you know, copyright issues, uh, the brands, you know, and the domain names, you know, how do you understand those things, and the whole legal issues surrounding those things is important. It was the first time that uh, people are hearing about those things. Um, we are also building capacity um, in terms of managing uh, your registrar registries, and also in terms of marketing, you know, and all of those are really bringing now some sort of value added to um, the whole internet ecosystem in Africa. So we are trying to change our, we are supporting actually. By adapting these strategies, Africa can leverage domain name systems to strengthen its digital infrastructure, promote economic growth, and enhance its visibility in the global online space. Resilience of domestic name systems infrastructure by investing in robust and redundant systems also helps in maintaining an uninterrupted access to online services even in the face of technical challenges or cyber attacks. By strategically leveraging domain name systems, Africa can not only strengthen its digital infrastructure, but also foster economic development innovation and connectivity on both local and global scales.